Hello, I'm Scott Ballard. Um, I'm here on behalf of my son Jalen to um, do a little bit of a demo for a, uh, an application that he actually created for me to use for music performance purposes. Um, this originally started off as a, a program built for Windows. I didn't have a, a, an, uh, an iPad at the time, so I had him create um, something that would be able to work with a Bluetooth pedal to change lyrics, to add um, MP3s to, to work in sync with those MP3s. Uh, and uh, we originally did that for a Windows platform, and then uh, I asked him if he could uh, build it for me for an Android platform since I uh, went out and purchased uh, an Asus um, memo pad. So, uh, to get started, um, I'm going to click on the icon Lyrics Flipper Plus, and you can see right away there's Start Playback, Execute Setlist, Filtered Start Playback, Fetch Data, and so on and so on. We'll get to all that, but first I'm just going to show the simplicity of it and basically what the main functions of it are. Um, so if I go to Start Playback, basically we have a list of all the songs that are in the tablet right now. And uh, some of these are just um, lyrics. So if I click on here, uh, 500 miles, I click on it again, and we see we have the first page. And if I go to the right corner of the screen, I actually can flip the page and you can see the next page. And uh, flip it again, you can see the next page. And there's one more page. And I believe that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and just hit the screen and stop it. Later on, this will work with the pedal. So your hands are basically free to flip through the pages of the song without having to use your fingers. Handy if you're playing guitar or something else. So let's do another one like that. Here's uh, the song Alive, Pearl Jam song. Hit it once. And uh, it's made that you have to hit it more than once so you don't accidentally, when you're scrolling through songs, so you don't accidentally hit you know a, a wrong song and start it. Um, so I'll go back to that one alive and I'll hit it again and so there we go we have the uh, um, we have the first page to it go ahead and flip it with the invisible button here flip it again with the invisible button and uh, gonna go ahead and stop it so that's basically looking at it um, in terms of just using your finger to flip through the pages now here's a, a song that actually will have lyrics and uh, an mp3 sync together and this is what we call auto turn basically you have the ability to time the page turns out to where you want to flip them in a song and it just you know doesn't take a lot of effort to actually make the auto turn files so I'll go ahead and click that one again and now we hear the the, uh, the mp3 for it So, now, trust me, it will turn when it's time for this, um, for these lyrics to change, but for the moment, what I'm going to do is go to a song where I, uh, made the, I made the page turns very, very short, meaning I didn't put a lot of text on each page, so I could show easier how the auto turns work, and it also has, uh, the, uh, audio vocals in it, so you can see how it fits together, so... Go ahead and start it.
just went ahead and stopped it. So sometimes I like to make the uh, the lyrics flip actually a little bit ahead of the words because you know I'm already singing the words, so therefore if I flip them a little bit ahead of time, I know what's coming up. So and you pretty much can get it down to a quarter of a second in terms of how you time the flips out, um, and they're edit you can edit them too. So if uh, you find that the the flips are a little bit too late or a little bit too early, you can edit each individual flip. Um, okay, so that's the basics of it in terms of what this program does. Now we'll get to uh, what kind of pedal works with it and what kind of pedals um, are out there in the next little bit. Okay, now this is my uh, Page Flip Cicada pedal. This is what I use to basically turn the pages for the lyrics and to start and stop songs and as I get um, as we talk about set list to be able to just you know scroll down set list and start songs and all that wonderful stuff too. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, turn on the power. Um, there's a button on the back re called reset and uh, what's going to happen now is it should find it. Um, okay. I forgot to hit search for devices, but now it found it. So I'm going to go ahead and hit dual pedal and uh, it's pairing. And just like that, it's connected. And you can see that if I'm holding it up correctly in front of this uh, other tablet that's actually recording the video, um, there's a button on the bottom here. I'm going to hit that one. And this is setting it to work with the, um, the way the Android works with the space and the enter, I believe is what that is. And this is how it works uh, with Lyrics Over Plus. So I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. And uh, I'm going to go into the Lyrics Flipper Plus uh, application. And I'm going to go to Execute Set List. And you see I have one set list in here right now called Drums Plus. I'm going to go ahead and hit that. And now with the left click of my pedal, you can see how that's just, you know, going downward and at any point you can just take your finger and, and, and go back up to where you want to go and that's going to kick it back into finger mode. Um, the way this particular set list is set up right now it's actually not really a set list that was made to just go boom 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 down the list. Um, it's more so just for me on a you know kind of a low profile gig if I just want to sit there and choose songs I can use my finger choose them and start uh, start them with a the pedal. So for instance uh, here we have, uh, uh, let's see, let's pick a song here. Uh, okay, this is crazy. It's actually a little CeeLo Green. And then I'm going to go ahead and hit the right pedal, and you'll see that actually starts a song. This one has auto flip. So these will flip automatically, just like I showed you in the video earlier. If I want to, I can still actually hit the left pedal and flip the page, but that would kind of defeat the purpose. Um, since they're supposed to already flip where they're supposed to flip. I can stop it at any time by hitting the right pedal. So just like that, the pedal on the right stops the song. So if we had a set list where everything was set up, and I'll make one in a second, you could see how this you know, would function pretty well. You just basically just go right down the list and uh, you know, start and stop, start and stop. Um, okay, so to go back to a song now with with regular lyrics, I'll go back to start playback where I have everything in here. Um, we'll take a song like, uh, okay, let's see here, Black Hole Sun. So um, to go ahead and start it, I guess I don't need to use my finger. I can actually hit the pedal on the right. And so there we have the first page of it. And then I can use the pedal on the left. That's my next page of it. And so on and so on. I'm just flipping through the, the pages right now. And uh, when I'm done with it, uh, go ahead and hit the stop button and that's it. Um, all right. So the next thing is you can build your set lists and your lyrics and all that stuff online, which I must say is very, very handy. But you can also build them on a gig um, in the actual application itself, which is nice. And then, of course, you can upload these things to the website if you want to save set lists, if you want to save... Uh, anything you make, um, that's the point of being able to have it all online. So what I'm going to do now is just create a simple set list. This time I'll actually pick some things that I, I know for sure have some uh, 
words and auto flips and things like that in it. Um, Footloose. Uh, here we go, killing me softly. Yeah, why not? Some super freak. Okay, so I'll go ahead and hit save. So it's kind of a kind of a short set, and then I will go ahead and hit new two. And you notice that the ones that are green, um, turn my pedal back on here. The ones that are green actually are ones that have auto turns in them. So these ones, and it's a, it's a way to let you know, green as in, you know, as in go, it's going to go on its own. So these things will flip when they're supposed to flip, assuming that uh, the user programmed them to uh, flip correctly. If you want to wait around for, you know, like another uh, minute, we can watch this thing flip. Sing along if you want to, it's a good tune. Here's about where we are right now, in case you're wondering in the lyrics. about right here. It's going to flip soon. And there we go. So now we're on our next page. And so on and so on. So I'm going to hit the pedal on the right and stop it. And uh, that's a little bit about, again, how the auto turns work and a little bit about creating the set list.